Hello everyone, ET Studio is here, and today I'm showing you how to record any Bethesda game full screen, no letterbox, using Open Broadcaster software, also known as OBS. So go ahead, download that from their website. I'll link that in the description below. I'll just go to it quickly. Just go to OBS if you don't see that link. And here we are. Just click on their Open Broadcast Software Home. And just click Download OBS Studios. That'll download 32-bit and 64-bit of OBS. You're going to want to open 64-bit or 32-bit if you have a 32-bit operating system. So just close that up. Go through the installation process and you will come up with this. Now, there's lots of different ways to do this. I'm going to go with the window capture, which is you set up like this. Click add, you go to window cap, no, sorry, display capture. Click OK. And you select full screen and capture cursor or not, depending on whether you want to or not. You click OK. And it comes up with this. Now this is obviously recording every single thing on the screen, which turns out to be quite a weird loop while OBS is open. But when I minimize it, woohoo. Now this works for Skyrim, which is what I'm using as a tester. So let's just go up, play. Don't open in letterbox mode, open full screen mode, 1080p or whatever the monitor is. And here we are, opening up Skyrim. It'll run fairly decently. If it doesn't, you can just set your frame rate down, which I'll show you how to do in a second. So here you are, everyone, in Skyrim with OBS. Straight from the start. Got my little companion over there. Let's put away our weapons. On top of a watchtower. Woohoo! I'm not going to do any spoilers or anything. I'm just showing you how to record. Basically, any Bethesda game. This is not going to turn out very well, is it? Oh dear. Well, that wasn't very successful. But as you can see, this uh, Skyrim is running fairly nicely. And you may have the occasional FPS drop while running it. But overall, this should be fairly decent. I'm just going to load up that save actually. There we go. Now I'll be able to do this without killing the horse. Let's just go down to the bottom of the watchtower and run around Skyrim a bit. So there we have it everyone. Recording Skyrim or Fallout. This also works with Fallout 3 and 4. And that is confirmed. So I hope you enjoyed the video. This is a really good opportunity for people to record their games there is another way to do it with recording game capture, but this is the easiest way to do it without having to alt-tab or anything constantly while in game. So I really hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a like if you did. Please leave a comment if you have any questions. And one last thing I'm going to show you just to prove something. If you want to change your frame rate output so it doesn't lag as much on the game, you'll want to go here and set it to 15, which is what I've got it on. You can go up to 20, it depends what sort of PC you have. If you've got a really good one, woohoo, you'll be able to record at higher frames a second. If you haven't got such a good PC, then set it to lower. So 15 is actually pretty good for even decent computers. I've got a GTX 950 and I still lag while recording. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, everyone. I really do actually hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you next time. Thank you, everyone, for watching. And goodbye.